Hey everyone, it's Kelly. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my new subscribers. And today I have a blessing to share some happy mail from my sweet friend Gina. She said Gina loves to craft. Need no introduction, I'm sure. She is YouTube's sweetheart and she's actually one of the very first friends that I made when I did a channel reboot. And I am so absolutely humbled and honored to have her as a friend. She is so sweet and so kind and so amazing to all of us here in the YouTube community. So just in case you are new to her channel, or new to mine, definitely go check her out and say hello because she is absolutely amazing. She sent me this during the holidays. I am so sorry, Gina. I did let her know that I had it. I accidentally put it away with some holiday items and I found it. And you know what? The timing is actually amazing because some of the things in here are really resonating with what I'm going through right now at the moment. So again, I call those godsidences and I absolutely love the timing of this. This is the beautiful card that she sent which I won't read but I did want to show that she included a sweet little die from Crafters Companion and it is amazing. Love the detail. This is going to be great for envelopes putting on the inside insert or even on the outside of a card. So thank you so much dear friend. I will treasure this. I am so excited to share this with you. She sent a stamp from the Greeting Farm. I love them. Haven't ordered from them in ages but I do love the little Anya and Ian stamps. Not sure which one this one is. I don't have it, so that's a great thing. It looks like a little top hat, maybe a little Mad Hatter going on here. <laughs> and I think it is just adorable. Can't wait to ink that up and make some cards and little things with this one. Thank you so much. She sent some Pink Fresh Studio. I love me some Pink Fresh Studio. And this is called The Best Day. I love these colors. It reminds me a little bit of Paris. I get like this Parisian feel from this. So I won't show you all of them, but I wanted to show you a couple here that this is a great way to make sentiments especially if you have like card making or want to do some layouts for some scrapbooking you can always take a die or scissors and fussy cut this out use this as sentiments this is really really great love that pink as well these oh, green my favorite color love these again you can cut these apart and use these in a lot of different ways so this is going to be fun finding different ways to use this ah oh, this is gorgeous i love the contrast and then this one with the little plaid is beautiful. Oh, I just saw a card. Oh, my, my mind just instantly made a card. <laughs> I'm seeing something here. Oh my goodness. All right, so this is gonna be, oh, it's the front and the back. Okay, I was gonna say, this is going to be a future card. Watch out for this one. Gorgeous, look how beautiful these papers are. They're so soft and pastel y. <laughs> so it's going to be a beautiful, beautiful set. Thank you, Gina. And she also sent some matching ephemera here. Let's snuggle up together. So it looks like some little beautiful florals in here. Oh my goodness, I can't wait to go through all of this in detail. Here's some more little ephemera. Let's take a quick peek at some of these. And I love these little baggies. They're going to keep me nice and organized. Oh, this is beautiful look so sweet unforgettable happy so it could be happy birthday happy day happy anniversary happy winter happy valentine's lots of different happies happiness Gina this is beautiful I love the gold and I follow pink fresh studios and if you see some of the layouts and scrapbook pages that their design team makes oh holy jelly beans let me tell you it is mind-boggling how beautiful you can take some ephemera and turn it into a va va boom i love this look at this some little chipboard plaid little circles so these are going to be awesome to add to my paper crafts as well self-care and this is what caught my eye it's going to be okay and you know this was not my week <laughs> as many of you know i did have a little surgery this week and then starting to like do that whole recovery process i have to go back again next week and so when i saw something like this i was like you know what yes it is and i just i just love this it's the little joys and take care of yourself the good stuff right here right now it's gonna be okay so i love this here's another one and this is called some days and these are the chipboard pieces and i really really love this i love big books me too i love reading i am a voracious reader lately not so much some days are tough but that's okay 
we get better and we can march forward. This I thought was hilarious. When life gives you lemons, this week it gave me the whole tree. Like it didn't just give me a lemon, it handed me the tree. But that's okay, I'm gonna keep going forward. And then here is another, oh, it's the same one. Oh my goodness, this is so sweet. So I won't have to worry about if I use one. It almost looks like a little, um, what do you call those things? Those little machines, the, the switch, I think it is. That's what that reminds me of. Here's some more ephemera. This this is amazing. I love this little Christmas background. I'll be able to use this in that journal that I'm putting together with all of the Christmas cards. I've gotten a little behind and I'm a little slow. Oh, I love this. These are little pockets and little um, journaling, little nooks and crannies, little tuck spots. This will be fantastic for that. Haven't journaled in a while, but this will be awesome to get back on track. Not only that, you can put these on the front of cards as well. Oh my goodness. I'm a library girl. I love li library cards, and I'm still looking for that elusive library card catalog. You know, the ones that aren't $9,000 when you find an authentic original one. My daughter does some antiquing, so she's still looking out for me as well, but that is my one item that has forever gotten away from me. I want a library card catalog the original one <laughs> so this is amazing thank you sunshine we got plenty of that here in florida look at this this is gorgeous i love all of these this will be great for um uh, like I said, for journaling and putting together some beautiful little tuck spots. Oh, these are so sweet. Thank you, Gina. I love, love this. This is going to be so much fun to organize and put this all where it's supposed to go nice and neatly. So when I use it throughout 2023, all of this will be right there. Here we go again. Some days, Pink Fresh Studios. Nope. <laughs> we are going to be okay. I love this. Love. Work hard and be kind. Always, always. Kindness makes the world go round. This is so sweet. I love this. These are stickers. Oh, it's double-sided. Okay. Didn't even see that. Be a nice human. <laughs> I love that. I said, what? And blank, I said, this is so funny. Well, this is awkward. This is really unique. I don't have anything like this in my stash. So these are all really, really funny. That's adorable. And then here, mental health matters, amen. And weekend wandering, catching up and hanging out. These are so cute. Tea time, when in doubt, eat sweets. And Ugg, trying not to freak out. Again, I saw this and I said, you know, this was meant for me to find this week. It was real, it just, it was there waiting for me to say, hey, <laughs> so much love. Ice cream solves everything. That and coffee. I can have coffee and it instantly changes my entire moment. Need more sunshine eating my feelings. These are so funny. I am so looking forward to using these in a journaling, card making, paper crafting, stamping adventure. Oh, one more. This one snuck out of the envelope. Look at this, my friends. She sent some Hello Kitty. Hello, goodness. I love this. I love everything Asian and Japanese and Korean. So I really love this one here. She's so cute. Look, a Mad Hatter. <laughs> I love it. The little strawberries. Oh, that's so sad. I'm going to put that, look at that sassy little face. I'm going to put this on my laptop. Love, love this. This is so cute. Love all the little strawberry. Boba tea. Hey, love that. Here's another one. Go Hello Kitty with her cheerleading. Here's a strawberry. Oh, love the koi fish. That one. There's a Florida one right there. I think that's going to be the one on my laptop. I'm going to put that one to the side. And Melody, her little best friend. I think yesterday, the day before, was Melody's birthday. If you follow Hello Kitty, she just had a birthday. <laughs> and look, here she is carrying her own cake. I love it. Cheerleading. And that's a lot what Gina is for so many of us. She's such an amazing YouTuber. She's everyone's sweetheart, I'm telling you. And she is an amazing cheerleader. And uh, I don't think I've put a single video up where she hasn't commented on it. And she just is one of the kindest souls that has ever, ever encountered in my life and walked this planet. Just such a beautiful person from the 
bottom of her soul. Gina loves to craft. Go check her out. She's linked in the description box below. Thank you, sweetheart. I am absolutely loving this mail. I can't wait to organize this and get started. Start getting my little craft on, especially since I'm home and resting this week. I'll be able to do a lot more crafty stuff. Thank you so very much from the bottom of my heart. Love you. This is amazing. Thank you so much, everyone. Gina loves to craft. Go check her out. As always, please remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe if you like my content, and I'll see you on my next video. Bye-bye.